guys, what is up, it is Rosa, and welcome to today's video. Today, I'm going to be doing a ship with me. It's my very first ship with me, so I hope you guys enjoy it. If you guys like ship with me videos, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet to the Rat Patch fan, and we have fun here all the time. Uh, 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 uh. Let's go ahead and get started with the video, girl. So I'm just wearing my normal shipping clothes. I'm usually in something comfy because shipping can take a while, and I schwitz really easily. If you guys don't know what schwitzing is, it's basically sweating um, in Yiddish. So... I schwitz a lot in in this house because it's kind of hot, so I always want to wear like a t-shirt and shorts, and I am near a window and it is open, so hopefully some air will come in, but I have a couple things to ship out today. I'm so excited for this freaking video, um, so let's just go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and ship the Poshmark uh, shipping item first. Uh, Holly purchased this. She's over in Alabama, so that's really exciting. Um, I want to get one of those maps that shows you like where you're shipping your items and um, all over the U.S. I think that would be really fun. That's going to be put into the budget one of these months, but yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and print this out. Poshmark labels always go to your email and then eBay labels are always on your website. I do want to show you guys real quick what I am using. I guess I'll show you as we go because I don't know, but my printer is the HP Desk Jet 3755. I have it in teal and white. I don't use the Dymo. I don't ship like thousands or hundreds of, not even, I don't even ship like tens of packages a day. So there's no point in me getting the Dymo, but um, I do have the, um, HP desk jet and I get the refillable inks that I pay for um, let me just put the light down here because I feel like The light wasn't working right. It's a little bit dark. So I will lighten this up for you It is about 7 41 p.m. So it is still light outside, but it is gonna get dark soon So the lighting might change a little bit in here But yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and print this out. The first item that sold was a Trina Turk dress It's super cute Trina Turk looks like this really really cute it's like a waterfall kind of or watercolor marbled looking dress i'm gonna go ahead and print this out and i'm gonna go ahead and start getting this ready to ship for poshmark you do not have to measure or um weigh your packages but for ebay you do so that's why i like to start out with poshmark first because it's a little bit easier all right guys i was trying to fix the lighting here through my camera but since i film in 60 fps it's not letting me do it, so it's fine. But I'm gonna go ahead and start putting this in the packaging. I just use clear packaging here. I will list everything that I use down below. Um, they're mostly Amazon and there's some eBay links and some other, uh, they're mostly Amazon and eBay links as of right now. The Amazon links are affiliate codes. So if you guys wanna purchase through those links, it helps out my channel a lot. I'm gonna go ahead and get this all nice and shipped. Pick up some of the air. I'm gonna use some stickers today. I always use stickers. Uh, it's the person I am. I really love kind of investing in stickers, but I don't know if I will invest in any more stickers um, unless people have sticker kits for like a dollar on Etsy or something. But these are this is the stickers I'm using today. They're just little yoga girl poses. So I have eight, so it should be enough. Actually, it's not enough. I'm gonna to have to actually. It is enough because I only have four clothing items. I usually use them for clothing items. I don't use them for anything else because I ship other things differently. So next I'm going to take one of these because I use this type of um, I use this type of shipping for my Poshmark packages. This is just the Priority Mary Tyvek or Tyvek mailing envelopes. They work really well for Poshmark. I'm going to go ahead and stuff this guy in here. Put in a business card, which just says, thank you for supporting my small business. And it just says my business name on there. And then I have a quote that says, the moment is all there. By the way, I totally got inspiration from Melissa here on YouTube, who does the ship with me videos. I think they are amazing. So I thought maybe I would try to do that myself and add more content to my channel. You know what I mean? Plus, it might be kind of fun. If you guys like these, I'll be really, really happy. So I like doing cool content for my channel and I thought that was a really cool concept so it has printed the difference between hers and mine though is I'm just gonna print them out you don't have to watch me like paste the label and things like that on it I don't think that's interesting I think just knowing where the item is going what's selling and for how much is more interesting for me so this one sold for $18 um, all right so now we're done with Poshmark we're gonna do the rest of them on eBay so I'm gonna go ahead and sign in real quick because it's not gonna let me 
ship without signing in, you know what I mean? And it's getting kind of dark. So let me go ahead and change up the lighting a smidge. All right, guys, so the lighting unfortunately had to change just because this is what I'm shipping. It's very flattering. Um, Rich just put in some new bulbs and they're super bright, so. So we're gonna go with the Trina Turk one first. This one did not sell on promoted listings, which is awesome. That means I don't have to pay for that promoted listing price. I'm gonna go ahead and print the shipping label for it. And this went to Amy in Kentucky, so that's really cool. This is what it looks like. It's just like a speckled LuLaRoe classic tee. I do think LuLaRoe still sells. A lot of people don't pick up LuLaRoe anymore, but you just need to pick up the correct items, I would say. And then for eBay, I like to fold it as much as I can because I need it to fit into a poly mailer. Um, yeah, so for me, I don't really want to pick up the classic tees anymore. I'm more of a randy girl. I really love LuLaRoe randies. Usually, like, all the sizes pretty much sell for me. But you want to look for plus sizes um, if you are looking specifically for LuLaRoe. I, I've noticed that they sell a little bit faster. And again, we're going to go ahead with some stickers. A little yoga sticker. Alright, and then the poly mailer, I use just this eBay poly mailer. But you can use any poly mailer. I just got these because they were on sale. And then we're going to make sure to get a car. All right. And then we're going to put that down. And then we're going to go ahead and weigh this. So I'll be right back. I'm going to go ahead and weigh this. All right. So this guy is 7.0 ounces. So I'm going to keep it at 7 ounces. And... Um, yeah, I don't have to change it up. You guys will see when I have to change up the ounces to round up. But for this one, I'm not rounding up. I'm just going to keep it at 7 ounces. Because the paper and the tape won't really add anything to it. So, I'm going to update. My shipping is $3.63 on this. So, I'm going to go ahead and purchase this label. And by the way, I offer free shipping on most of my items except for... Oh, spam is calling me. Most of my items except for things that are over 14 ounces, I charge shipping on those. So when something is heavier, I usually have it listed for more, and I don't take, like, really low-ball offers. Sometimes I take low-ball offers, but it really depends. Like, low-ball meaning, like, 50% off, I won't do it. Probably, like, up to 30% off, I will. So while that is printing, we will start with the next item. The next clothing item that we have is this that also did not sell on promoted listings and i'm going to tell you guys what sold on promoted and what didn't because with promoted listings you have to pay once something sells so it's kind of a bummer but at least it helps get exposure to your store this is from the brand charter club it's just this really cute giraffe tee so this one is going to melissa she lives in california so i will have to pay sales tax on it so I'll probably always tell you guys that too. So in the state of California, if you do business within California, you have to pay the sales tax. For Poshmark, I don't have to anymore because Poshmark takes care of it, which is awesome. They already charge the person for shipping or for sales tax if they buy it within California, I'm pretty sure. Um, and then for eBay, I still have to pay sales tax because I am not charging for sales tax on eBay. So I still have to pay sales tax for California, sales tax for California, and then an extra tax for the uh, for the county that I sell in. But that's like within the county. So like I have to pay sales tax if I buy or if I sell something within the county of San Mateo. So luckily I think I've only done like two or three sales this year in my actual county. So I think I'm gonna be really good on sales tax. Um, all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and package this guy up. I almost closed this is actually 6.1 ounces meaning I will have to round out to seven ounces so we're gonna go ahead and weigh we'll put this to seven oh, not seven pounds sorry seven ounces I, I always say sorry to my computer I'm gonna go ahead and update that and update my address because for some reason it likes to keep my home not my home address my parents home address on here but I'm actually shipping for my PO box which by the way I should check that thing 
roughly soon. Maybe I'll go tomorrow and check it, but I think I need to go get gas tomorrow, to be honest. So I don't know if I'm gonna have time to check it tomorrow. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and purchase the label. The label was $3.22, because this was seven ounces. So we're gonna go ahead and put this on top of here, and then open the label. Come on, dude, work with me here. And then we're gonna print. By the way, if you guys do taxes on like your own, like if you have this as a business, definitely make sure to keep track of the eBay and Poshmark fees because those help you a lot to lower how much you owe in taxes. So definitely keep charge of that. I learned the hard way last year because I didn't really put any commissions last year because I didn't realize I was supposed to keep track of it. But it's August, so you only have to backpedal a couple of months if you want to do that. So. Just letting you know now, at least for my state. So I don't know how it is in other states. All right. And now the final clothing item we are going to be shipping out today was sold via promoted listing. So that means they're gonna take a couple of cents away. Like, I don't know how many cents, but um, they're gonna take probably less than a dollar from this. And this sold for $13. It's an American Eagle Outfitters women's floral top. I got this at the grab bag sale, so it literally cost me, I think, $1.50. So I'm happy with that. Um, I did do free shipping, so that eats into it, as well as PayPal fees and eBay fees. So I probably made around $5, $5 on this, but that's still better than nothing. So this is just what the dress looks like. It's really flimsy. I just picked it up because it was a grab bag sale, so like I wasn't worried about it, you know what I mean? I'm gonna go ahead and start the shipping process, print shipping. I have never been to Michigan, but most of these states I will say I have never been to because honestly the only states I've ever gone to was Seattle, which is not a state, but Washington. Uh, obviously California because I live here, Florida, and Alaska, and yeah, that's about it. That's the only states I've been to, at least that I can recall, so. All right, so we're gonna purchase this one. This one was $3.63 for the label. All right, and then the final items are going to be games and a laser disc. So we're gonna do the games first. The first game that sold, oh, let's go. The first game that sold was an N64, Super 64 Mario. That's what it looks like. For these, I use sexy bubble wrap. And I only take off a small piece because it's like a game, it doesn't need that much. And these are like rip your own, so it's never really that sexy to rip, you know what I mean? So. I'm just gonna go ahead and take a piece of bubble wrap. So if you guys ever wanna sell these, you can sell them like this and it's not a problem. I always put the pamphlet first and then I actually, no, what do I do? I don't bubble wrap the pamphlet, I'm sorry. I just bubble wrap the game and then um, I put the game in a, what's it called? In a clear poly mailer like so for extra protection then i put the uh i put the manual in there now this might not be the smartest ever but it's the way that i've been mailing out games forever and it hasn't god forbid backfired me so i actually slip so as you could see i folded i'll show you in the next game but i folded the two ends like behind the game and then i slip this inside like the little crevice that it creates so it kind of creates a little bit of a barrier for the manual and then I go ahead and I just take it like this. I don't even seal them. I take it like this. I put it in a poly mailer. You would think I would put it in a box, but Rosa doesn't play. Rosa likes to play with fire sometimes. If I don't, if it fits in a poly mailer, I'm not going to put it in a box. I do this with my um, video, my DVDs as well, but DVDs usually have like a case. Um, I wish I could put the laser discs. discs. <laughs> I wish I could put laser discs, discs in there like that, but I can't. And then I actually don't measure these because I know roughly how much they weigh. So this one is, yeah, I'll keep it at five ounces. They're normally around four to six ounces. So five ounces seems pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and edit my thingy. And then the total for this, since it's going first class 
uh, USPS, which I haven't been telling you at all. But all of these, except for the Poshmark one, is going two to three day USPS mail because that's the one I normally use. I could have used media mail, but to be honest, I really don't care. Like I'll do, I'd rather do USPS. I do media mail for my laser disc because that is an arm and a leg to ship if you don't do that. So open that. Then I'm gonna go ahead and print it out. I'm gonna see if I can actually, can we put this on here? Oh my God, we can. Lovely. So the next item I'm gonna go ahead and ship is Conker's Bad Fur Day. If you guys find an N64 of Conker's Bad Fur Day, just like this or with a manual, pick that shit up so quick. I'm not even lying. Sold this guy for 80, how much did I sell you for? $85, had it up at 90, 88, took a best offer of 85. So this was also sold via promoted listings, which kind of sucks because it was a higher end, um, it was a higher, what's it called? And item, so the promoted listings is a little more, but you know what, it's still a lot of freaking money, so I'm very happy with it. All of the funds go to my wedding, so I'm very freaking happy about it. shipping out is gauntlet legends another n64 game and it came with the manual so we're gonna go ahead and bubble wrap start the process <laughs> So there's a huge debt-free community here on YouTube, which is crazy to me. I had no idea it was a thing. I feel like I never know it's a thing because reseller community, I had no idea that was a thing either when I first started. I kind of, I kind of just started to really save money. I mean, save money, make extra money. So that's why I got onto Poshmark. This one's going for $3.63. So all, all of these are really going for $3.63, which is awesome. So. I was actually pretty shocked that there was a large community of people that follow Dave Ramsey. Well, there's a large community, but like on YouTube following Dave Ramsey and doing Planet With Me's in there, Ann Condren. One of my really good friends, like I've mentioned a million times, Romina, she does them all the time. And that's kind of when I started doing my own. Oh my God. Are you going to explode? No. Okay, great. So that's why I started doing it and I just was fascinated with this debt-free community. Like everyone is paying off $45,000 in two years, $100,000 in two years. I'm like, Jesus, I mean, I wanna pay mine off in two years. If you guys know, I actually have 34,000 at the moment to pay off of debt in general, just with like everything. It's probably gonna go a little bit lower after the wedding, but I will be able to really buckle down and pay off my debt. This is why I do resale. This is also why I do YouTube. Well, I, you know, that's not why I do YouTube. I've been doing YouTube for 10 years. I do YouTube because it's hella fun and I really like it and it gets my creativity going or whatever. Um, but not or whatever, it gets my creativity going. So I love YouTube. It's just, fortunately, YouTube started paying creators a couple years back and I really didn't get start getting paid until probably the middle of last year so I've been doing it basically for eight years seven years without getting paid so everyone's starting now where they're putting I'm gonna put my YouTube income here I'm gonna put my YouTube income here and I'm like man if only you started when I started because we did this shit for fun we didn't do this for an income we did the shiznits for fun so what am I doing okay I'm going back okay I'm doing I'm doing it for fun so I was kind of like shocked that people put that in their budgets and I was like oh well I guess I'll put mine in my budget and you guys can see like how much I'm making on YouTube and on res and on resale stuff and share a sale now share a sale I did join to make money like I do want people to purchase stuff for me next we have Pokemon Stadium another N64 game and it came with the instructional manual so we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing all right print 
eight ounces. I don't think so, Tim. We're going back to six ounces. Um, this one went to John in Georgia. All right, so funny story. I have no idea where I ended because my camera stopped recording. So I apologize in advance if like half of this was skipped. I don't know what the hell happened, but just in case you don't know, um, I'm starting to ship the Pokemon Stadium N64 game. It's already packaged and the rest of this is gonna go to music. real quick I'm just gonna show you before the music continues the next item I sold was a WCW revenge this went to an Arturo in Illinois and I believe it sold for $14 so we're gonna go ahead and get this all done So the last game we are shipping today is called Dragon's View. This is an NS, SN, SNES Super Nintendo game for the Super Nintendo console. SNS advice? And it says made in Japan, so I know it's legit. I know it's legit because it's rigid from like the 90s, so it's fine. I know it's legit. Oops. I accidentally printed out two labels because <laughs> I don't know. It's fine. This one went to a Phil in Louisiana. So thank you, Phil, for your purchase. Girl. All right. Now, finally, is the big kahuna, which is this laser disc. So this laser disc sold. This thing is so heavy. It's like two pounds. Well, it's probably a pound, but it sold. This one's a special edition, so it had the insides. But this is Schwarzenegger's True Lies. And this sold for a whopping, let's see, a whopping, don't even know, give me a second, give me a second, a whopping $3. But for this one, I did paid shipping. Anything I do on auctions, I do paid shipping because just in case, I like don't want to lose out. So, and this one is going to go for two pounds and it's going to go USPS media mail because it is a media and it's super freaking heavy. So if I did this regular priority package, it'd be $10.54. Media mail is $3.27. So it's just going to take a little longer to send. But this is where we're going to build a box together. We're going to build a box together. And the boxes I use are just these recycled boxes. They are a 13 by 13 by 4. I got a 13 by 13 by 6 last time, and let me tell you. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. That was disgusting. Also, I gotta go get scissors because I'm gonna be using some tape. So, this is gonna be fun. Can't wait till I'm seriously done shipping all these damn laser discs and selling them because making these boxes is a pain in the tuchus. Now, give me the beat. So I don't think that was enough for the bottom. So let's just do this. Let's fold this a couple times here. We're gonna fold it. That's a sexy fold, Rosa. Okay. Fold it and then we're gonna do a third one. It's a little bit longer. That should be good. Are there actual lines in this? And I just didn't know. Maybe. So as you can see, this one's a little bit longer. We're gonna go ahead and try to like put it equally on each side. Now we're gonna snug it as a bug. Snug it as snug as a bug in a rug. I think that's what it is. I'm gonna put true lies in here. Good night. Sleep tight. Enjoy your two to eight day travel time. And then we're gonna put one more bubble wrap, like folded over bubble wrap. 
All right, guys, and that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was a little up and down, definitely, but I'm sure the more ship with me as I do, the better I will get at it. Every time somebody starts something new, they're obviously gonna be a little rough, so I'm sorry about being just a little bit rough in this video, but I know that I'm gonna find my groove soon, and once I do, we should be smooth sailing from there. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know any tips and tricks, you guys. Um, think that I should do during these videos. Um, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to check out all my links down below. Also, if you guys are interested in my glasses, they are Warby Parker and I do have an affiliate link as well down below if you guys are interested in new glasses. Super easy online. You can try on five glasses for free and if you like a shape, you can go ahead and purchase. They are as low as $95. Um, and I think these were like a hundred and hundred and like 20 or something because I got the blue lenses like the blue reflecting lens because I'm always on the computer so I needed blue lenses as well as that's it I think that's the only upgrade that I got for them and maybe anti-scratch I don't remember but yeah definitely go ahead and check out the affiliate link down below if you're interested in new glasses and I believe they also take insurance so I would double check on that though but anyways I'm gonna go I love you guys so much thank you so much for watching like this video if you liked it subscribe if you haven't to the Brad Patch fan and we have fun here all the time uh, 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 uh. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye bye. Yo, what's up? I'm the mad hatter. I'll pour you tea, please don't let it spread. Does it really matter? Cause I'm the mad hatter. <laughs>